Sage here for Calcine Media. Thanks again for joining us and please stay watching for our next educational topic. Today we're covering Treasury Yield. What is Treasury Yield? Well, it represents the total amount of interest earned in percentage terms on the US government's loan commitments like Treasury bills, notes and bonds. In other words, Treasury Yield is the effective loan cost that the US government pays to acquire cash for various time frames. Understanding Treasury Yields The types of instruments used by the government include short-term maturity instruments like Treasury bills that mature within a year, Treasury notes issued with a maturity period of 10 years or less, Treasury bonds issued for investors' long-term investment goals of 20 to 30 years. So how do they work? Financial specialists that buy these Treasuries indirectly loan the government money. Treasuries are considered the safest way to invest the money as they come with the US government's credit and good faith. Investors earn profits in the form of returns, commonly known as coupons, for investing their money. The amount of investment yield for lending money to the government depends on the market's demand and supply trend. The US Department of Treasury issue the bonds at an auction to all the successful bidders. The bonds come with a fixed interest rate and face value. Fixed interest rates are then maximum rates that an investor can earn. If the demand for bonds at auction is high, the bonds are issued to the highest bidders at a relatively higher price than its face value, lowering the yield. On the flip side, if demand is less, bonds are issued at a lower price than their face value to the bidders, allowing them to earn more yield. Treasury yield as an economic indicator. One can predict the future on, on the economy using treasury yields. The more extended the period on a treasury, the higher is the yield. Financial specialists require a better yield for keeping their money linked up with the government for longer periods. The higher yield on bonds provides extra confidence to the investors regarding the certainty of the economy. Investors keen to flow their money in these government schemes for a long-term basis, keeping their money safe. On the flip side, when the yield on long-term bonds is less than short-term notes, it creates a situation for economic recession and brings uncertainty in an investor's mind. In such a case, investors aren't keen to tie their money with the government for an extended period. Thanks for your time watching. Sage here reporting for Kalkine Media.